I don't know what I'm what doing! Are you doing around the ah! ah! Shit! 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 Oh shit! Fuck me! Oh fuck me! Ah! 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 Shit! My 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 what the fuck? Ah! My ah! I don't want to fucking know! Fuck! Stop screaming! Stop! Hi guys, welcome back for another video. So I've come to the conclusion that you clicked on this video for one of two reasons. One, you're curious about this photo essay or two, you're sad as hell and you need more semantic error content because there's clearly not enough. I'm so excited. Oh, so I actually purchased this as soon as the last episode aired. I just knew I had to have it. This is like one of my favorite BLs and it's super sad to think that the director wants to do a season two, but one of the main actors, so him, he is enlisted right now and he won't be coming back, what, for 18 months? I'm not really sure when the enlistment period is. I think it got bumped down a little bit. I'm not sure, but hopefully in the near future, we can get a season two. All right, so let's get this open. I've only seen this photo essay maybe once or twice, and most of the time I was seeing it on that V Live that Jay Chan did. So I thought this was my receipt, but nope, it's just a thank you for ordering from us. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It's so much tinier than I was expecting, but it's still beautiful. Oh my gosh. Almost got scared. I thought that said one, so I thought we might be getting a second one, but that's just my brain. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I'm not ready. I'm not ready to relive some of these. Ah! <laughs> okay, let's see. I guess I can go through these first or maybe last. I don't know, we'll go through it first. So we have some postcards. I believe this was um, for pre-order. I think you guys can still get it if you order it now, either from, I think K-Town for you is selling it and then I'll link where I bought it from. But we got this cute little scene from episode eight. And then photo cards, which I am not surprised that they included this with the photo essay, but I'm not complaining. Now moving on to Jay Chan's baby. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he looked so proud when he was showing this all. But right. got a printed signature. I'm so happy they came out with this. I only have like one other photo essay, and I think that's from one on one, but I really enjoy them a lot. I really also like the
I'm also sad. I'm always in sad girl hours because I really want a season two. But I think they did a phenomenal job with picking the actors. Jayon's teasing wasn't overly annoying because sometimes in BLs they can get really annoying, but I found it super cute. This height difference, I'm living for it. I live for a good height difference. I think uh, Cherry Blossoms After Winter has another, that's another one that has a height difference. And that's also another Korean BO. Um, if you guys want one to check out. He was so petty for this. <laughs> I wouldn't have told him what I hated and what my what my least favorite color was. This was super cute too. Gosh, I really wish this wasn't just eight episodes. I feel like they definitely could have made this much longer, but apparently the webtoon is ongoing. So I don't know if they just didn't have enough content to make it longer, but by the time he comes back, they should have enough and hopefully we can get another season. <laughs> oh, poor baby was going through it. Not him buying up all of the black coffee drinks. This scene, I feel like there's way too many scenes like this where the like freshmen or underclass go out drinking and the seniors act up like i just can't stand it i you're supposed to be setting an example and yet here you are drunk up <laughs> okay i know they weren't on like that level but like running away 101 you should always be holding hands still it was cute also the scene right here Ah, oh, made me feel things. I really like how he just slowly comes out of character. He's very, um, I guess how they explained it in the drama, like robotic. He just, he's very punctual. He just has a certain way of doing things and they have to be done that way. But then he slowly comes out of his, you know, ways and he's like doing things that he never thought he would do. And I find it super adorable. Also, bestie, she's best girl. Best girl. Ah! Not the wigs. Oh, man. This scene was intense too. I'm glad that I waited to watch this uh, this BL uh, after all the episodes aired because I would have struggled trying to wait for the next episode. This this broke my heart. That broke my heart. He did not have to be like that.
Oh my gosh. Yes, the pat on the head. Oh, it was so cute. And I love how Jae Young respected Sung Woo's personal space, like not wanting him to touch him. So he grabbed, strapped his book bag. is also one of my favorite scenes i was not expecting this i was not expecting this i don't maybe none of us were or maybe some of us i didn't read it so i didn't know this was coming so i was very much surprised when it happened oh the feel it oh my gosh this scene also i replayed it at least i want to say at least 20 times stop it Get some help. Was not expecting this as well because usually we get really stiff kisses in Korean BLs, not gonna lie. But they really delivered with this one. Oh wow. They really gave us like every angle. Cute. I love how he went and he told her off. Like, I like him so. Yeah. There's some really good photos. My heart is so happy right now. They are ugh, my serotonin boost. This is what I need. I need another series that's like this. Well, not like, like this, but you know. That makes me, oh, we get behind the scenes, shut up. <gasps> no. Ah, so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh I missed them already oh this is really cool I like their Instagrams oh that's it Oh man, but yeah, I will definitely be supporting these two in the near future, but I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. If you did, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!